Hey, this is Dr. Fast here, and in this video I will show you how to maintain your shop vac. And many of you do have a shop vac at home, and a lot of times you use it for a year, two years. And you don't even remember that, you know, these uh, have a bag system in there for you to remove and replace, and you might want to clean up the uh, filter inside. So let me show you. On this one I have here is a shop vac, and this model is a QP. S35, it's an older model, I've had it for about uh, 10 plus years. So basically there are clips on the side, top side here, unclip it, and then you remove the motor assembly. Okay, and there's a filter here, a paper filter, and also inside this model there is a uh, paper bag, or they call it a filter bag, that you can loosen up on this vacuum intake here and you can remove the old bag as you can see this one's really dirty uh, actually I have not replaced it in uh, probably three years two three years I don't use it a whole lot but it's it's kind of half full right now so remove that now before you put in a new bag on the bottom of this paper filter you can turn this counterclockwise And just gently pull the paper filter out. Now, if you find that it's very dirty here, get a soft brush, okay, and just brush off some of the dirt and dust. So you can use a brush like this and just go through the pleats. And just brush all the dirt that's accumulated in the pleats and clean it up. Now, if you find that there's still more debris that's stuck in between if you happen to have a compressor get a blower gun like this and from the inside blow air from the inside out and go through every piece And there you go, it's nice and clean now. Now as for the uh, filter bags, this one is made by ShopVac. This pack is a pack of three and they're disposable so every couple of years you can replace it. Depending how full it is, you might have to replace it every, every year. Now if you're going to use a uh, paper bag, this type of uh, filter bag, it's only meant for dry pickup or vacuum you do. If you're going to be using the shop vac to vacuum water and uh, standing water you do not use one of these paper bag okay so this is one of the replaceable paper bag here and you just basically just open the bag a little bit so you have some opening some space in there and then there is a rubber seal around here. What you want to do is put this rubber seal around the vacuum hose here inside the canister and push it as far as you can. Like so. And then we'll put the paper filter back on. Put the end cap Screw it clockwise. Like so, and then put this back on. Close the clip, and that's it. It's good for another year or two before you have to do this again. So, anyways, I hope uh, you enjoy this uh, video. If you have any questions, I'll leave a comment below. And if you like the video, please subscribe. Thank you.